can't believe how obsessed those people were with that Fred guy. So weird, right? I mean, were they really that different from you with Jesse? I, what? No, you, I, I am a stone cold professional. Petra, come on, stop giving Radar such a hard time. All right, all right, sorry, Radar. That's okay. So, uh, what's the compass saying? We still heading the right way? Hang on, let me check. Seems like we're still on. Tracks out, everybody brace yourselves. Ugh. 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 Uh, rough ride. Man, the track is a complete wreck. Yeah, what's up with you? Only one person I know fights like that. You are the real Jesse! Ivor? <clears throat> yes. It is I. Your friend Ivor. I'm a ninja now, Jesse! What? Yeah, what? It all started when I fell through a portal into some sort of strange world. Everything was all white. Ivor? Master Shadow's domain. He claimed he was a ninja master, a practitioner of the shadow arts. At first, Ivor, I wanted I nothing to do with insane. him. He was a very suspicious character. But eventually, after a lot of uncomfortable eye contact, he asked me, me, to be his pupil. I was confused at first because he didn't exactly present his credentials or curriculum, but I'm always open to learning. I'm a student of life after all, so I said yes. Before I knew it, I was punching trees, cleaning floors, all as part of my so-called training. At first it seemed pointless, but after I had punched a forest's worth of trees and cleaned miles and miles of floor, two things became clear. Sometimes, doing menial tasks can be an amazing way to learn martial arts. And sometimes, strange old men just like tricking people into doing their housework. <laughs> anyway, it all worked out because now I'm a ninja. And my newfound ninja skills helped me find my way to you. Are you... Uh, are you done? Please, please be done? Ha! Huh, yes! I suppose I'm doing a lot of talking. I just had a lot to say after all of that quiet and mysterious business. It's so good to see you. This is insane. Oh, you know you missed me. Uh, hang on, you tried to kill me. Ah, uh, yes. That was an unfortunate way to reunite. Let me explain. You see, it all started when Harper and I returned from our vacation. We discovered that while we were gone, you had mysteriously vanished. After fighting a prismarine giant named the Admin. Right. Only to return. Having defeated this Admin and taken his amazing powers. Wait, what? Yeah, that's not right. Oh, that is such a lie. Just thinking about the Admin, running around, pretending to be me, makes me sick. Yes, I would be frustrated too. Especially seeing how convincing the admin's disguise is. Jesse, a.k.a. the admin, gave me this and told me he had reprogrammed it to find the fraud, a.k.a. you. But with my new ninja's senses, <clears throat> I could tell something wasn't right. Anyone who disagrees, anyone who questions Jesse, disappears. 
Oh, they must hate me. It's certainly not helping your reputation. No! But I knew that Jesse, the real Jesse, would never act like that! That's why I decided to try and use this opportunity to discover the truth. Luckily, it worked out. Because I would have felt terrible about killing you. Classic thing to say to your friends. I can tell you're being sarcastic. But you'd be surprised. Wait, 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 wait. If you weren't convinced, you would have killed me? The admins turned everything upside down, Jesse. It's very confusing up there. Speaking of whom, I can't spend much more time down here. If I don't get back to the prison soon and report in, the admin will know that something isn't right. That's perfect. You can make up a lie and you'll never suspect that I'm actually down Which here. will buy you the time you need to find Fred's weapon! Hold on! How'd you know about I'm that? I'm a ninja! Anyway, that plan is all well and good. But what exactly should I tell the admin? It needs to be plausible, but dramatic. Yeah, believable, but entertaining. Realistic. But shocking. But tell him that I escaped, but that you trapped me down and took me out. Yes, I'm sure he'll be delighted by the description of our epic confrontation. Your final desperate struggles to cling to a fading reality. You're a real poet, Ivor. Ninja! I'm sorry I can't stay longer, but I must go. Go. We'll see you when we get back to the surface. No, oh, wait, can I borrow that amulet? Certainly, but why? Long story involving a portal and a magic frame, but it'll help us get home. Please hurry. It's getting dire up there. Smoke bomb! <laughs> ah! You saw nothing. <laughs> you saw nothing. We all just saw that. Right? I, I didn't, like, hallucinate Ninja Ivor? Nah. uh Just when I thought that crusty dude couldn't get any weirder. And we're ready to roll. Come on, guys.